For the battle between Romans and Gauls, see Battle of Cremona. For the battle during the year of the four emperors, see Battle of Bedriacum. The Battle of Cremona took place on the night of the 31st of January to the 1st of February 1702 during the war of the Spanish succession between a French force under Maréchal Villeroy and an imperial-slash-Austrian army led by Prince Eugene of Savoy. Chapter 1 Background The duchies of Milan and Mantua were strategically important as the key to southern Austria. The French took possession of both in early 1701, but Emperor Leopold then sent Prince Eugene to recapture them. He was an extremely capable general who easily outmaneuvered his French counterparts, winning battles at Carpi and Chieri, after which his army took up winter quarters in the pro-French Duchy of Mantua. Lack of funds and supplies from Vienna meant Eugene had to improvise, since campaigning in the winter months was not usually done, he hoped, to take the French by surprise. Chapter 2 Battle Eugene had a contact inside Cremona, a priest named Cousily, on the night of 31 January 1702, he admitted a party of imperial grenadiers by means of a hidden culvert, and they seized control of the St. Margaret Gate. Once open, approximately 4,000 troops led by Prince Eugene in person took the French by surprise, many being killed as they emerged from their barracks, and Maréchal Villeroy captured in his quarters. A second and larger force under Prince de Vordement was intended to storm the Po Gate and the Citadel but was late in arriving. This gave the garrison time to destroy a vital bridge and prepare, the assault being repulsed by two units of the Irish Brigade, the Regiment de Dillon and the Regiment de Burke. The defenders now regrouped and counter-attacked, with daylight and a French relief force arriving, Prince Eugene ordered his troops to withdraw, the Austrians having suffered an estimated 1,600 casualties, the French around 1,100. Chapter 3 Aftermath The two Irish units lost an estimated 350 out of 600 men engaged, their commander Major Daniel O'Mahony was later presented to Louis XIV and knighted by the Stuart exile James III. He went on to have a distinguished career, fighting in Spain and Sicily, he ended as a lieutenant-general and died in Aconia, Spain in 1714. Vouleroy was soon released, but his capture commemorated in verse, Par la faveur de Belloni, et par un bonheur sans eagle, nous avons conserve Cremorne et père de notre general. The battle was also commemorated as a march entitled the Battle of Cremona later used in the Irish Brigade.